Cheers, this is Amber from Happy Caravan. I'm a mom of 10 kids and we live in New York City. And today, we're going on a grocery haul. First, we're going to Costco and then we're going to Trader Joe's. I'm gonna show you what it takes to feed our family of 12 for a week, so come with us. Even though it's the middle of the summer, it is raining. <laughs> Quite a bit of rain in New York City. I wasn't expecting that when we first moved here, but I guess that's to be expected. are sleeping. <laughs> we made a few wrong turns, but we found it. And the cost goes right up ahead. Our ticket. So here's our car. And here's the view <laughs> from the parking lot, which is quite a pretty view actually. Why are you hanging on a dirty railing over there? Yeah, the railing's really dirty. You're in the cart, huh? Uh, my little butt hurts. <laughs> We're on our way to Costco. We have our little, one of our friends with us. Elijah's in the cart, <laughs> temporarily. His butt hurts. So. He's that big boy. We're getting to tuna. My can help us with that one. Ooh, it's so Melody. Funny. Yes. <laughs> getting some organic extra virgin olive oil. Okay. We're having a little snack of the guests. Some <laughs> trying some. What is that? Mm -hmm. is a little pancake. Mm -hmm. Victoria free samples. <laughs> is that good? Yes. Here, Mo, do you want a pancake? She made you a little yeah, pancake. Yummy, yeah, Mo. It's a pancake. Try it. That's you want to so try good. it? it try it, Mo. Syrup. You want to eat it? You want to try it? Nummy, nummy. You're a stubborn you head. <laughs> oh, well. So, you know, we found us a jam and some full mold. No, yeah, I think we already have maple syrup. No, because um, if I Okay, so we're gonna get some red berry cereal for the kids. No, I really like this one. You know, we found some granola and you know, some granola. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> Melody wanted us to edit our cart. She wants honey nut Cheerios instead of red berries, so we're getting the Cheerios. Okay, so we're getting some chicken thighs. We're gonna make some barbecue chicken. You wanna find us a good date? <laughs> He's a good date picker. Okay, Mark, Mark found us a good one, so. Here we go. Chicken thighs. Ooh. So Mark found us a good date on the drumsticks. This is what we eat on Saturday. Just have some chicken legs and some sort of vegetable. Just something sort of easy. Although know, last Saturday I went kind of crazy and made pretty chokes, but <laughs> it was worth it. Ah, Naomi found us our chicken broth. Thank you. I forgot to get that. Quiet. Two point four pounds, so about three pounds would be fine. Thank you, Naomi. So I'm making beef stroganoff. I've never made beef stroganoff before, so. This is what we say we're supposed to use, so we're gonna be brave and try it. Okay, so this is this is top sirloin. The other option was ribeye, but ribeye is even more expensive, so we're gonna stick with the top sirloin. Here's our beef. So this week in the crock pot, I'm gonna try and make like a Vietnamese pork loin dish. <laughs> so. Um, What's great about this though is I think we could probably get two meals out of it, so that's actually pretty economical. Okay, so here's our pork loin. I think 
it's called. Did, did, did I write down on there what it's for? I think it's called a. Dada? I forget what it's called anyway. Like a, Can you say Dada? Let's see. So it's for something called Bon Mi rice bowl. So it's supposed to be Vietnamese, so I'll tell you if it's any good. Okay. Fresh mozzarella. I'm gonna make fresh mozzarella pizzas for the kids for lunch one day. Kids, kids found a <laughs> found a sample. Ooh. The tija. Yeah, that's Mexican cheese. That's good. <laughs> Mo is gonna try the Mexican you cheese. Are you gonna try, try it? Yeah. Try it, Mo. See if you like it. Oh, he's nervous. <laughs> it good? So great. Cheese. Mm, pretty good. It's huh? cheese. Yeah. You eat. I'm trying to put that mango cake. Wow. Okay, show me what it is, Noah. Mango cake. What do you think? Is it mango? Yeah. yeah. Yummy. So. Got some couple of Greek yogurts. Okay, Mark, Daddy got you a sample. What's that a sample of? A little sausage. Thing. A little sausage. Uh, what is it like? It's a sausage, like. A little sausage. He likes the cake better. <laughs> Do you like the cake or the sausage better, Moses? Let's see. Taste test. Oh, oh give me one of those bad boys. <laughs> I didn't get one of those. Elijah wants one. Okay, we can't be like spending too much time here. Mm -hmm. keep you don't want it? He's not so sure about the sausage. Oh, he likes the sausage. You like that? Okay, maybe not. Okay. I'll eat it. <laughs> Wait, did he spit all over it? <laughs> I just shivered about it a little bit. So Naomi is searching for a nectarines. Okay, I need to put some of these back Hold this. Are these good? I think. Okay, so I'm not sure where these nectarines are going to go, but... Yummy! Yeah. Okay. Get... Here's some like yellow kiwis. You know, Naomi's been <laughs> picking us out some fruit. So where do you make those? Huh? To your mouth and then to your tummy. Getting some tomatoes for just about everything we put tomatoes on. Have some... Probably some tostadas this week, I think. Should so go to your mouth, right? And yes. then also, and then probably with our fresh mozzarella pizzas, which will be good. So we're getting some pears. We're gonna have like a, a pear salad, and then also they're good for snacking. Mark found us a melon. Did you tap on it, Mark? <laughs> Sound good? <laughs> I think it's okay. It's fine. Yeah. Hopefully it'll work out. There we go. Joe oh, watermelon. Okay. You always rearranging things for us. Trail back in there, re rearranging the cart so everything fits. So we're making quite a few things with carrots this week, so we're actually gonna spring for the big big bag of uh, organic carrots. There we go. Not sure where to put them, I don't want to smash anything. And then Mark also found us some um, two of these Tuscan melons. The kids really like this. So Naomi wanted to get a pineapple. I'm not sure what, how to find a good pineapple. I saw some person squishing the bottom. So oh, are they I don't know. Is it squishy? I don't know. I mean, it, it's hopefully I it's even good. looked it up. You looked it up. What does it say? Ah! Give the pineapple a squeeze. It should feel firm, but give very slightly when ripe. Okay. Well, it'll probably be okay. It's only well, $3.99, which is a great price because everything else is so expensive. Maybe they're in season or something. Mark got us four bunches of bananas. Kids use them for snacking on top of cereal and then also for smoothies. They are the wonder fruits. Bananas. Bananas. Do you like bananas? Assortment. Okay, so the kids wanted to get these prunes plums. or plums, like dried plums, but um, they have potassium sorbate in them, so she's looking up to see if potassium sorbate is bad for you. I don't know. What does it say? Well, geez, when used in personal care products. Okay, so it's safe for most people to eat, but may cause skin allergies. So I guess we'll bravely give the pitted plums, dried plums, a try. So we've got our cucumbers. We're going to use that for the Vietnamese 
bowls that we're making and then also some other things. Oh, we're gonna have some pita, hummus pita breads. Will you help me make the hummus, Lijan? They're the best hummus maker in the planet. So we're gonna get some of these grass-fed beef patties. We're actually shopping this week. We're shopping for a week and a half. Usually we just do a week, but thinking about changing my shopping day to Tuesday because shopping on Sunday after church is a little bit boring. <laughs> we're all a little tired. Oh, like maybe not. Thank you. So we're getting some strawberries, cherries. Also getting some blueberries, kids love snacking on these, smoothies, all that good stuff. Mark, uh, got, <laughs> Mark found us six gallons of milk. We actually drink more than this, but this is all that will fit in our fridge. So, so we use for now. Found our pomegranate juice. They still don't have my acai, but they also have some organic green juice, but I make my own green juice, so. <laughs> Getting two pomegranate juices. Kids love drinking that. Especially just that. Mm -hmm. So we're getting some ginger lemon kombucha. Back to our sharp cheddar cheese. I'm getting three cheddar cheeses. Okay, so well, I'm just gonna put it in the cart for us. Thank you. Mark's gonna go back into the cold zone over there and get us some eggs. Mark is special delivering us uh, some eggs. It's like Gaston. He's got the eggs above his head. <laughs> grass fed butter. Two, I think we need two of them. Yeah, we go through this pretty quickly. And then, what did you find? What is this? Ice cream. Ice cream and berries. I'll oh, give man. some. Okay, so the kids found these helados in Mexico and they want to get them. So we're getting them. For the kids. Is that good, Enoch? Got a little ice cream snack there. <laughs> you can have it, Melody. Okay, say thank you. Kids are in love with the Squishmallow <laughs> assorted plush collection. Kind of oh, she got you an ice cream, Mo. <laughs> mm. What do you think, Mo? That's good. There's berries, too. You got tomatoes. <laughs> um, yeah, I got tomatoes. Kids are going to the food court. I don't have money for you. Um, I, I have some money for her. Like off they go to the food court. <laughs> We're gonna finish up shopping over here. Getting some baby wipes. <laughs> to Ned. Okay. There's other stuff. Okay, so we're looking for turmeric. Sorry. <laughs> looking for the turmeric. Anyway, so we're getting some turmeric. And then we're getting some Lysol, Lysol wipes. <laughs> She's the, <laughs> she gave us a good presentation and we need some, <laughs> we need some Lysol wipes. <laughs> Clean our bathrooms. So we need some napkins. Got our, oops, <laughs> Mark. <laughs> got our napkins and Mark also got some clear trash bags. Those are for recycling in New York City. You have to put your recyclables in clear trash bags in your recycling truck. Pick some up. Mark braved the Mark braved the crowds and got us some water bottles. <laughs> this is the full cart Mark's gonna check out. I'm gonna go uh, see the kids at the food court. So the kids are waiting at the food court. It is busy today. This is a busy day everywhere. <laughs> Just waiting at the table. <laughs> want the, I do not want your water bottle in my purse. Do you want some pizza? Maybe somebody will share their pizza with you, Moses. Got all of our food court buddies here. 
Ketchup emergencies over here. <laughs> hey, Mark. <laughs> how, how much was it, Marco? Five seventy-nine eighty-nine. The barge exits Costco. On our way to the car. We are now way into the elevator. So now Mark finds a way to make it all fit in the van. <laughs> He's very smart at that. And we have to find a way to fit ourselves in the van. Mark's bringing in all six gallons of milk. That's very impressive. Daddy <laughs> Thank you, Mark. Here, we'll find something for you to so Josiah's working on his gold dragoon, gold dragoon's coat. Yeah. Yes. It's going too well, okay. Mm -hmm. Let me try. What a helper man's is. Good job. <laughs> and bring in more. Want to go and bring in more? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's go bring in more. Let's go find something else. Here. You're helping. What a biggie one. Want to bring more? <laughs> you bring in the cheese. Good job, Mo. Well, I'm just gonna try the dried plums. Chloe. Hey, why are you Okay, so what? what are your thoughts on the dried plums? You like them? Good. You good? Three? Uh, yeah, whatever the serving size is. Thank you, Mo. Do you wanna go get more? More? Oh, you're such a helper. <laughs> well, that's why people need to go out. Oh, Mark put all the groceries away. Well, Mark and me and the kids, we all, team effort, put all the groceries away. And now we're on our way to Trader Joe's and it is raining again. <laughs> this summer rain really throws me because I'm from San Diego and we don't get rain in the summer usually. So even Moses helped. Did you help Moses? Did you help put the groceries away? So, getting in the rain. <laughs> Brought an umbrella, but I don't think it's actually raining right now. <laughs> Just in case. It's nobody here cares about it. hanging out over here. Kids enjoy the rain. <laughs> And it's so warm. It's like warm in me. So they have a banana plant, but I don't think that would go very well here. That's a San Diego thing, I think. <laughs> first thing, first things first. Kids want some chocolate. Let's see here. I think Eliza likes the milk chocolate with almonds. There we go. So we got some blueberries. So we're getting some frozen fruit. Kids like to eat this and also put it in smoothies. Oh, I must have forgot to write it. <laughs> I think I put it somewhere on there. Okay, so we got some frozen pineapple. And then we're going to get some frozen mango. Also getting some peaches, those are good for smoothies too. Okay. We get some frozen ginger, it makes life easier. We put it in our beans and other stuff. We're gonna make a frittata this week, are you excited? I'm gonna try a spring or a summer vegetable frittata. Okay. Give Mommy? It a try. Yeah, baby. Okay, that looks like fun. Some cookies for the kids. 
Aussie style chocolate cream sandwich cookies. Getting some triple ginger snaps. Okay, so we've picked out the cookies. We got way more chocolate chip cookies. And the ginger snaps and the Aussie style chocolate cream sandwich cookies. I've got my tea. I need green tea too. Should I get some? I'm a tea, tea girl. Look at all this tea. I always get all excited in the tea aisle. Thank you. This is my green tea. <laughs> okay, so we got some well rested tea and some green tea. Mark already got me some Earl Grey tea. Missing Pearl because she's my fellow tea drinker. So they, I got the last two feet of reds. Man, they're low on their red. This is what we get for coming <laughs> later on. We're having some hummus sandwiches. Getting two corn tortillas. We make some chilaquile. Chilaquile. That's pretty hard to say. It, but this is eggs and peppers and all that good stuff. This is for the kids for snacks. Sometimes people ask, what do we do in between meals? We have like yogurt or bread or butter or something like that. Just try to make it not too exciting so they still eat their meal. <laughs> so for Saturday, we don't have my regular bread. It might come time to bread, so I'm not sure what to get. If you want to try this sliced marble rye, once again, it's the unbleached enriched flour. I'd love to make my own bread one day, but I'm just not there. Maybe that farmhouse on Boone lady to teach me her bread making tricks. <laughs> Which makes it look easy. Yeah. So it's not. Okay, so English muffins. We're gonna have some English muffin pizzas. And since I'm buying these, I'm basically buying for a week and a half. So I'm gonna get two packs of them because next week I'm gonna make tuna mouths too. There we go. I know I've got my English muffins. Okay, so this is actually for. Um, next week, so I'm probably going to put it in the freezer because I'm planning on going shopping next Tuesday instead of Sunday. Uh, yeah, we're not opening those until we get home, buddy. So, I think we're going to get some ciabatta bread because they don't have our regular baguettes, but this looks pretty good. Actually, maybe I'll get one. Oh, did you find the Legos? Those look like fun, Moses. We'll make a sourdough bread too. Here's our goat cheese. This is for our frittata that we're making. Silver goat shovel. Goat cheese. And for the frittata, we're also getting some parmesan. And some chips because the kids like to have nachos on um, Sunday night. So, getting some blue chips. Like yeah, we need some salsa too. We're getting some salsa verde. And more salsa verde. And just I really likes this red salsa. So we're getting three of those. For Naomi, she's always baking something. There we go. She has flour. Mo's going in the backpack. <laughs> so our next item is cocoa powder. And Mo is the bearer of the cocoa powder. She has a cocoa powder house. Good job. So there's our cocoa powder. Mo put it in the cart for us. Put it in there? Thank you. Give me five. Yeah. And there's some almond milk. Good for smoothies and all sorts of things. Mark is the bearer of the Cuyosa, poor Cuyosa pasta <laughs> It's Noah's birthday and that's just his request. Naomi's been making some, I think she's making some chow mein and then also pasta Put this one in. Noah's birthday is not this week. This week it's Josiah's birthday. Josiah's making some very interesting things too. So, but he wanted to make his own cake. Yeah, he wanted to make his own cake. He's ready. And cut for Rumi for pizza. Here's all our goodies. Put them in the cart. Okay, what? Yeah, this is all they have. Low moisture part skin. It looks a little different, doesn't it? I noticed it was different. Yeah. 
Yeah. Which is the right thing. Also, gonna get it some of this raisin, but I know I like this sometimes. I like it too. It's a good snack. We're gonna pick some peppers here. <laughs> Let's see here. Here you know, we're getting Ed and Mommy probably for Noah's birthday, and then we're getting some green peppers, and some green onions for some Asian meals, and also for the frittata that we're making, and some, oh, also for tuna melts. Yeah. I'm gonna get some spaghetti squash. I have no idea how to make it, but I think I've had it before, so I think it should be possible. I'm gonna do that for Saturday with our chicken legs and chives. This is for, I think this is for the top of the frittata. I think I have to check. Oh no, this is for the top of the beef stroganoff. See how that all them Champs Elysees said, I guess. This looks kind of interesting. I was gonna get spring mix, but they do not have spring mix. The kids already bought their snacks. <laughs> They're eating some snacks over there. And then they did not have power to the greens mark, so I am getting some baby kale. And I'm getting I'm getting this instead of spring mix. I'm not gonna make the walnut salad. I think I'm just gonna do something with that. Got some pizza sauce, yay, for a pizza. And then here is Kansas City organic barbecue sauce and it doesn't even have corn syrup in here. Let's make sure this pizza sauce doesn't have corn syrup. Let's check uh, corn starch, but no corn syrup, so. Yeah, I just wanted to check. So they just stocked up some green cabbage here, so we're gonna get this for Naomi because she's making chow mein and it needs some green cabbage. Mommy, I'm gonna take Moses to the bench. Okay, because <laughs> a bench that they usually eat there. Snacks up, so I don't know where to put this cabbage. You know, it's kind of running out of room here. There you go, Mr. Cabbage. Here, it's a good cart for sure. You're not. I got one kind of healthy. 22 into all the way to the back. We're all the way in the back. So here's part one. Enough is fishing. Part two, which is not that full. We are bought into our basket. It's pretty, pretty empty. Okay. Shut up. Bean beans to the rescue. <laughs> Everyone is waiting in here because it is raining out there. I'm so thirsty. If you're if you're ever thirsty, just drink. Get this. That's good. We're all chilling. It's wild here. Aw, thank you. She got me a nice treat. Thank you, Chloe. Yeah. And you got some mangoes. Good, no. And so let's walk carefully across the street. And it's a little break in the rain. So we're just going to put the groceries away. Okay, so while we were at the store, someone broke in the van, but thankfully we have nothing valuable in here at all so anyway so how much was it mark uh, 23688 23688 so it's better than last week <laughs> moving in the right direction disappointing that people broke in but good thing we didn't have anything i know i'm surprised looking at our van that anyone would think to break in here but that's okay So we are back from Trader Joe's and now we have to put all of our groceries away. <laughs> Thank you for joining us guys.